What happens after death? This question has remained unanswered for centuries. Despite extensive investigations, we still have no definitive proof of the dead. So we set out armed with basic equipment to find the proof of life after death. This is paranormal exposure. Yeah, let's get out there let's first. Wow, we made it. Wow. As we're here, we definitely mean no harm. We mean no harm to anybody that's here. We've just come to look. Alright. Really heavy, yeah. We haven't come to, to take anything. Because remember, he was scared people wouldn't take his money. We haven't come to take anything that belongs to you. Right, we've made it, we're in Landon Hill. We've actually found the well now. It's so heavy. What was the what was the, the fella's name? Edmund. I'd have to go off to oh. look. Don't worry about it then. Right, let's go. Let's we'll get out then. Just been in there. For a few seconds, it felt like sort of screaming on my throat, and uh, it didn't feel good at all. I haven't felt like that in a while. Get my breath back. Right, we're at Langdon Hill found it eventually um, we've just found the well as you can see where there's been a lot of paranormal activity um, we're just sort of finding our feet at the moment we ask that whatever is here to Step please forward. do not do not ex uh, affect us negatively we're here out of respect. We don't mean you any harm. No disrespect. Kane, you all right? You all right? Mate, I don't know what the hell that was, that fucking... That was a grip on my breath, I took my breath away straight away. As you know, there has been a lot of reports here about, or and stories about different paths and depending on what one you go down like it a headache coming on now. tells a different story i'm starting to get a really heavy feeling in my chest that's what into my gut it has my throat and straight into my lungs like so squeezing no i can feel it in my chest um i mean no i'm no disrespect i just want to come in and give you yeah. a voice there it is just trying to I'm, i feel quite sick hang on Seriously, you lot are really feeling something. I've got a lump not. in my throat. I've got a really bad lump in my throat. Why don't you say the Lord's Prayer and then start again? Sorry. Um, I'm just going to say a quick prayer. Sorry if it bores you, but I've got to do it. Um, 
Ooh. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the power of the kingdom and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Okay. Say amen. Um, amen. Right. Uh, Say amen. Um, amen. Right. Uh, amen. Cain. Say amen. 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 Right. Uh, I don't. I can't. I can't. I can't even. I can't even think. I'm shaking. Um. Sorry, guys. I'm just gonna go off a second. Give me just. I'll, I'll come back in a minute. Sorry. Um. Not sure if you've picked any of that up. <coughs> We've just arrived at the well at Langdon Hills. Um, Kane and Shamim both feel not right. Um, um, I feel all right, but those two aren't feeling very great right now. So this could potentially be a short one. Um, if they're not feeling great, then you know we're not going to push them to do something that's making them feel uncomfortable. So hopefully they'll be all right. You alright? I'm good now, yeah. No, I'm alright. Um, I reckon we should get the spirit box out. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> no, 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 no. I've just gone dizzy. What the fuck? It's exactly what, exactly what I had when I first walked in here. Dizzy, it felt sick, I couldn't breathe. No, no, I don't feel sick. There's also children I here. 20 children apparently. Oh guys, I don't know if I like that. I felt fine. I felt absolutely fine. I'm not dizzy. I just went disorientated a little bit. Um, I, d I don't know what that was about. There's people coming up. Is there? Yeah, there's a couple of people out there with torches. They're coming up. Have they got pickles? I don't know. Have they got pickles? I don't know. So we were just counting, we could then do photos as well. Oh, did you? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Yeah, we're still recording for our channel. <laughs> oh, oh We're doing yeah. paranormal investigations. <laughs> oh, superb. Um, and Sorry, do you want me to get out of the way? No, 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 you carry on, you carry on. Oh, just doing a quick walk. Quick walk around. Well, it's good for church. Ah! Back of the cemetery. Alright. Trying to push it down. You go up the A13. What? You've got the cemetery in front of you. You go to the three cemeteries in front of you. Turn left. The party entrance to the cemetery. The road goes straight down. And then round to the right. And you go down the hill. Oh God, Shamim, you scared the crap out of me. It's all right. Oh, is there? So, so that torch will go down there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not with you, I mean, don't worry. <laughs> no, we haven't got you on camera. No, that's oh, fine. That um, no, the photography for Fright Nights. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, really? Yeah. Nice. Um, so, do you know a lot of history on this place? This place is owned by a local farmer, Cash. The Cash family are still around. Um, farmer Cash made a lot of money out of this well, but somebody else opened a well close by. Okay. And they were selling more to cheaper than him. So Farmer Cash went down and poisoned the other well. 
Oh. I don't know if deaths occurred because of that, but he did get locked up for it. So what? what is the story with the children, though? Children? Yeah, a lot of people have said about children. That I don't know. Because, you you know, um, well, I think... Well, that's really it, informative, actually. Well, about well, the, that he poisoned. Um, yeah. Well, that would explain why we felt a bit funny. We've all... You've been up here before. Most times, yeah. Yeah. So, every time you've come up, have you ever felt I've been ill up on, in any way? I've been up here on my own, and I've really felt like I'm being watched. Yeah. I didn't like it at all. Yeah. Uh, a friend of mine, Phil, was up here doing photos on his own, mm -hmm. and he said something hit him hard around the back of the head. He oh, said, There was gosh. nobody else around. He said, Nobody else around at all. And I said, What happened? You know, I just grabbed my gear and ran. Uh, you know, yeah, I, mean? I probably would have done the same thing. But, like, have you have you ever felt like uh, dizzy, disorientated in any way? Because just that I'm being watched. Because yeah. he walked into this bit and instantly. It felt like something was heavy. grabbing my throat and like squeezing me. I had to stand over there for a minute. And then not long after, Shameen, she started to feel quite sick and I felt fine. So I went and documented on my camera that I felt fine. I walked in there and I was like, whoa. Then I started feeling it's a dizzy. very heavy, heavy feeling in the chest. Yeah, I've not had that. Just feeling like I'm, I'm being watched. Wow. Up here. Wow. But if you go to Bowers Gifford Church, back at Pixie Cemetery, mm -hmm. You get a lot of paranormal groups down there. Uh, there was two of us down there doing photography at night. Uh, I mean, mate, Lee kept saying, uh, "Kept seeing a black figure moving over there." I didn't see it. I didn't look. I didn't take any so notice. It's oh, not here, but I was <laughs> given. Um, I didn't see. I didn't take any notice of it. Mm -hmm. um, I just carried on the photo stuff. Uh, I was there two nights later on my own. I walked into that cemetery. Walked along. As I looked up, 20 feet in front of me, there was a black figure. Leaning a shovel, shovel's like that, he's got his foot on the blade, but glaring at me. Wow. I instantly got the feeling this bloke really does not want me being here, really angry. Mm. Um, I'll carry it on. With Fright Night, so I took their medium down there. Now, me and mate Lee didn't say anything to him about a black figure being down there. Mm. We walked in the cemetery and he was chatting to us. Um, <laughs> oh god, he's behind. Sorry, <laughs> that frightened the life out of me then. Yeah, that bit of people. Um, yeah, we walked in with the medium, he's chatting to us. And he just stopped talking. He said, it was a black figure just moved across there. Wow. And he said to us, it's the groundskeeper. He was a caretaker here. And part of his job was to keep people away. Oh. oh wow. I said, oh, right. Then I said, about seeing the boat with a shovel. Yeah. Um, wow. And the medium That's asked him, has he seen you before? Mm. And he said, yes, he has. Wow. But that was part of his job, to scare people and keep people away. Oh, wow. That's amazing. He, there was also a bloke, because that church, St Mary's of Antioch, uh, you've got a railway bridge there, and a bloke got chased along that railway bridge, caught on top of it, he was stripped naked and hung off that bridge, oh and then he's supposed to haunt it. There was a paranormal group down there one night, uh, and had the spirit box going, and that was just sitting on their car, scanning frequencies. We all heard a really loud scream, scream come through that. Oh, wow. Yeah, I think we need to chuck out the spirit you, box, don't you, in the yeah. K2. And I've used my K2 down there, I've got K2. Yeah. Um, I've used that down there and it's very active. Is it? Very active, yeah. Wow. But you do get a lot of paranormal groups down there. It's also a dogging area, so you get a lot of them down there as well. Oh but dear. <laughs> that might be interesting. Just don't flash your lights, you're alright. Wow. That's well, amazing. before. Oh, man, we've managed to find well, it. Well, should we do a quick session in here of the spirit box before they do their thing? Yeah. 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 Is that alright? Is that alright? I'm more interested. Right, oh, right. thank you. Have you seen the witch's grave at Pitsy? No. No. Um. St Michael's Mount, obviously Tes we got Tesco's at Pitsy. Right. You got the church tower up on hill. Right. But if you go up there, as you walk up, <coughs> right beside the church tower, it's quite a long grave. And it's got a here lies the E can't think of the name now. But it's got a head and and Freeman. And it's got a here lies the evilest woman of her race, he calls her an evil vile worm. Local legend says she was a witch. I don't think it was because the date is too late for the witch trials. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, local legend says she's a witch, but no grave, it really stays her off. Wow. wow. We'll have to try and find that um, as well. Let's do a quick. I know you don't want to be on camera, so if we have picked you up, I promise We're really, you. I, will I don't think well. I did. I might have caught that's your leg or your arm or no, something. No, no, that's, <laughs> that's fine. Well, we'll do a quick session right. then. Right. Um, do yeah. I have to go back in there? It's like our last one no, we done. Oh, sorry. We all got no, we heard way, he's a big one, ain't he? Got called a pussy and a wanker. 
So, oh, thank you very much. <laughs> I've got nowhere to put the K2. Yeah, I'll put one in the well. near the well, isn't it? There. Right. Um, we're starting the spirit box. If you hear anything, please let us know. Hope. Hope? Hope. Hope. Oh, I'm going to come and sit next to it so that I can no, pick it up on my Is audio. Oh, I can hear you talking. Hello? Hello? If you pick anything up, can you let us know, please? If there's anybody there, could you please come and talk into this device? device. We're here to just give you a voice. We're not here to do any harm, cause any problem. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. It's What's your name? I'm speaking. Sorry, what was that? What was your name? Fire? Did I say fire? Fire, fire. So anyone here, can I make this key, can I uh, put the light on the key too? We've also got the K2 going. We're at Langdon Hills, the well, um, at Edwin Cash, hope we keep the money. Right, so is anybody there? Can you please come and talk through the spirit box, a little device in front of us? <laughs> No harm. Can you tell us your name? Are you male or female? Come on, we've heard a lot of history, you've scared a lot of people. You've made us feel uncomfortable, many other people. We're giving you a voice. I just said get fucked. <laughs> we just seem to get insulted well, wherever we go. <laughs> well, yes, I was just like, yeah. come on, we've come here to try and give you a voice. Oh, I think I just caught an orb coming out of the spirit box, you know. Well, that's not like Did it say well? well? Away. You're going to tell us your name? EVP, Mine's broken. Oh, is it? Yeah. It you didn't get to play? Nope. I've got mine. What? I'll do the EVP when we turn that off. If you guys pick anything up, can you let us know? How long have you been here? Did you die around here? Ow! Are you watching us? Are you here with us now? We know you're around, so come and talk to us. What? Be clearer. You don't understand. No, uh, Rianne, there's no one inside the well. It's literally... <laughs> that's what it is. It's filled with water now. K2's not even going at all, is it? Oh, little spike. There's no one here, make the K2 go to the red. We're getting some responses, but it's so it's not hard to make out. Yeah, can't even make out with it. Don't speak tomorrow about Ouija boards, she'll run away. <laughs> Lot 
Come on. 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 I'm going to go to the red for us. Come on, make it go red. And do you affect males that visit here? Then go to the red for us. Come on, push it to the red. We know you're here. Yeah. What's your name? You can't probably tell me your name. It said something then, but... Thank you for doing that, but we want to see it go to the red. Thank you. Come on, push it to the red. Come on, push it to the red. That's it, thank you. I hope my camera's picking that up. You yeah, well, thank it. you very much. Thank you so much. As you can see, it's getting pushed to the red. There is nothing around it, as you can see, guys. No electrical, nothing. Thank you. Can you walk past this window? We appreciate it. Show yourself you by this that. window. I think it actually just did as well. A girl said, uh, sorry, uh, Lou, uh, I'm sure Who? I read Adrian. Lucy? Oh, that's my sister. Oh. Hello, Anne. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I heard Adrian and he's been there 50 plus years. Right, it's still going. If there's Some someone here, can you nice. show yourself by this window, please? Well, I've just said, if you're here, to show yourself at this window and it looks like an orb comes from right, out there in. in. Can you step away from the K2 and go out screen for me? Oh, well, it's getting worse. You can step away now, please. Run and hide. That's how like I said, run and hide. No. <laughs> Shan't. Let it go back to green, please. Step away. As you can see, a bit more of that. We did ask them to go to red and it's exactly done that. Can you step away now? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. They are five years, so I'm absolutely crazy at the moment. I mean, there's none of us are near it, there's no electrical near it at all. Yeah, every time I'm standing here, I'm fucking in it. Language, Timothy! It's still going quite nice. Come on, tell us your name. Step forward and tell us your name. You have a spirit box there. You can talk through it and device. You need to be clearer so we can hear you. Yes, they murdered or something. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't laugh at that. It does, doesn't it? Um, Do you like anyone being here? Can you step away from it now, please? If, if no. Not, you need to tell us your name and who you are. Why are you setting it off like that?
Brianne. Just find the cash here. If it's you, Mr. Cash, go to the red on the K2 on this little device we've got in front of us. No. If it's somebody else. Stop the K2 if it's not. I love you. That sounds like you said I love you. Your price wants the picture, so you take the torch. Ah. Uh, I don't know what it's doing. It's lighting this up so the camera. The lens is locked open on the cameras, and this just means that uh, wherever I light up, the camera. <laughs>